Okay, Dean, let's start with part A. Now, to begin with, you didn't format this the right way. It should be 5 by 7 at 120 PPI. <coughs> Excuse me. I posted a tutorial on how to do this in week one, assignment two. Secondly, please do not include these margins. Uh, let me get my pointer. Please do not include these margins. Just include the image 5 by 7, 120 PPI. Now, here's the other thing. For something like this that's tall, don't shoot it horizontally. Uh, and also, you're coming very close to the edge of the frame here with, with this, you know, with the vase. Leave a little room. You have plenty of room up here. Bring the frame down so it's more centered. And this kind of background is not really an acceptable studio shot. You have to be able to have the viewer suspend reality, put him in a fantasy world, so to speak. This kind of line in your background isn't acceptable. Um, in the beginning of the course, you were given certain parameters how the background had to be a certain S curve on your table. Also, what is all? The, what are all these scratches here? That's also not acceptable. I'm sorry, D. I gotta. I gotta. I gotta tell you this stuff. Okay. Now, more likely, you should crop it like this. See, but still, it's not the right size. So you gotta get it down to one, 120 ppi, five by seven. Now, you would have been better off choosing a vertical off of your contact sheet. Okay, something like this, and then, and then, move it away from the background. Use a shallow depth of field so you get something more like this. So you still have focus up here in this area, but the background is getting out of focus. So you can have the viewer suspend disbelief. This is uh, image number. Oh, I can't get it, get it up to that size. Hold on a second. Yeah, image number one, 6176 off your contact sheet. Okay? So just so you know. All right, now moving on. Here's your glass figurine of the Blessed Mother. Now again, this is the wrong size, please. No white margin. And you're cutting her off at the bottom. Again, why, you know, don't do that. Don't cut off your subject. You would be better off picking a vertical off your contact sheet like this. And plus, a blurred background. Shallow depth of field, uh, soft background. You don't need to include so much background. Uh, that's pretty much it. Okay, if you have any questions, give a shout out. I'll help you along. All right, D, take care for now.